try something a little bit different for today's vlog. Tim and I and a couple other people are going out to a new bouldering spot that I've never been to. And it's all very strong. Like it's it's super strong climbing. I'm talking like there's like one V5 and then the rest is like V7 to V13 I think. So well above my pay grade. I'm obviously, I'm still gonna climb, but I'm gonna try to make this more about their climbing and, and their experience. Maybe make like a mini climbing documentary out of it. So I hope you enjoy. <laughs> Creek. This is where all the hard people come to throw down and some really sharp rock that's very uncharacteristic here in Southeast Queensland. <laughs> it's just awesome. You know, we've got little caves down here, we have this huge blade of rock, we've got some hard projects. Yeah, this is this is where you come to throw down. So this thing requires a lot of like weird heel toe compression, very, very balancy. I think Finn McCallum, he sent it, rated it as a 12. And uh, I learned that he was doing some different beta to what we were doing, myself and Drew, but you know. There's so many different ways to climb a boulder, but I think I've figured it out, except just one move in the middle, which requires me to ooze off a crimp and then snatch the next one. And that's, that's the one that's very elusive. And now it's like, I've got that doubt where I'm like, oh shit, maybe I shouldn't be spending time doing this. Maybe it's like a high left. And then they're both kind of meeting in the middle. So it's maybe like, do I have to change the whole way I, uh, I approach this boulder? Mm. So like, I'm willing to throw out all the beta that I've learned. Do you want to just talk through the holes? Sure. Can we start? Okay. Because so I also have no idea how this boulder works. You start with a pinch in your left hand, right hand's down this crimp. Your right toe comes up to hook this, and then you bring your left heel. You can't see where it is, but you want to smear it right here. <laughs> so you can get enough power to crank through the heel, bump the left hand up into this, and now you're in this weird position where it's like my right hand has to up into this. But it's so hard because your right foot is trying to smear as much as possible but you don't want to push too hard lest it pulls your left heel off and you don't want to flag too far left with your right foot because when you go for that everything swings out and you just cut straight away. So I don't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> but it's so cool. It's like now it's... What grade is it? Uh, Finn put it up as a 12. Um, remains to be seen what the actual grade is afterwards. Personally, I don't think it's a 12, just because of how far I'm getting on it and how quickly I got on it. Um, I'd say it's probably like a 10, maybe an 11. Yeah, give it a shot. That's the yucky stuff, but it feels so good. It's like, I've done the top so many times, I've got the start so many times, and it's just the one move that just makes it all together. This is a, like, really cool place. Tons of hard things here. Um, I'm really keen to see you on this one, actually. <sighs> yeah. Did the warm up a lot faster than I expected. Inspect, expected. Um, yeah. I think we're ready. I think I could probably pull that off just. How are you feeling about it, Timmy? I'm a bit nervous. I know the moves. Um, it can either go down really quick, or it's gonna start punting off silly things I usually don't fall off. But uh, yeah, no, I know the moves. Today it's like, I've found it's best to go into this with no expectations, because you start freaking out once you actually do the move that you've been struggling to do for ages. So it's like, all right, if I fall off now, I'm gonna be completely okay, because I can always pull on again. Yeah. Okay. At least that's justification for myself. <laughs> Come on, Tim. And then snatch the next one. And that's, that's the one that's very elusive. Oh! No! Yes! Yes! That's the fucking move, man. <laughs> I've never fucking held that before. That was yeah. sick. Caught it on the finger, and I wanted to readjust. 
Bang, bang, bang. Yeah, catch the finger. Don't readjust. It's like one of those climbs. What you get is what you get. You can't do anything more with it. They're high. They're really high. Now here's the thing. It's like, do I try again, or do I wait ten minutes? <laughs> wait. Tim, Dude. I reckon you've got that tonight. I hope so too. I think you've got that in the bag. Ugh. Cheeky rest and give it one. Cheeky rest and the friction is just oh so good. <laughs> oh so good. It's like that little catch. Before, whenever I took my finger on it, it just slipped straight off, but there's this little crystal. Once you catch it and you wrap around, and you go, yes. I'm kind of disappointed in myself that I didn't throw for it. Like, I tried to readjust, even though I knew that it was pretty pretty dicey doing that. You know. No, I'm, good, just, eh? I'm amazed. That's cool. That's really cool. Ah. Ah. All right, I'll try this one again. Come on. Give me your old man. Come on, man. Come on, Tim. Good. Three. That's it. Come on, Tim. Come on. Well done. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Good job. That's easy. Yes. training <laughs> how was that Tim <sighs> it felt so good latched it and then I actually had time to little readjust to get my fingers in a bit deeper throw up and you're like yeah yes. <laughs> <laughs> two attempts man <sighs> two shots man how long have you been working on that how long I've been working on this probably over a span of eight months it was kind of the same with the v tennis cedar how it hit it really hard for a few sessions. Didn't touch it for like six months. Came back on Thursday. Had a lot of shots like this, probably like 10. And then today, it's and like you know, in the shower, you blast the cold water, at the end of your shower, go through each movement. And I can't like have a mental break because if I do, I have to start the whole thing over again. Get it so dialed in your brain that when you rock up, you know how those holds are gonna feel, where you're gonna go. And it's funny though, like the, the tonight was the first time I actually latched that. And then again, it's like I know exactly where point I'll snatch into it. Oh, what's the grade? I mean, I wanna say 12. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna, yeah, I, I'd say for me, this would be a 10. Let's see how quick I went on it. it was solid. Yeah, that was super solid. Really good. Think, I don't think this finger could have taken too much, <laughs> too much more. Like, I'm being a little bit melodramatic, but like this thing's pretty, pretty thin, because you really feel the crystals in that crimp you throw into. You like, but it's good though. It's like the safe cracker who like shaves off all his fingertips. You actually feel the intricacies of the rock, and you know where to push your hands. Nice. Yeah. Rush it. Cheers, crunch. So good. Now I'm going to climb for a little bit. <laughs> Sesh report. Sesh report. We got it done. We came here, didn't take any prisoners. Had strong warm up, good mid game, late game was really good. You know, we all just came together and uh and yeah, we just like just came together as one unit. Me and the me and the homies just smashed through and just yeah, feeling great, feeling good, feeling pumped. <laughs> I'm just trying to emulate NRL players. Yeah, <laughs> they, no. they, they me and the boys them. really did good yeah, tonight. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's skedaddle! You ready? Phew.
Nice bend too. Thank you. Good climbing with you. Awesome. Thanks guys. Yeah. Awesome. Until next time. I'm coming. <laughs> You're coming with me. You. <laughs> oh, me. Bye Tim. Thank you for climbing. See you later. <laughs> later dude. Alright. That's it. Let me know what you thought. Let me know if you liked that. I think I, I, I mean, I really enjoyed making it. I haven't edited it yet, but I, I hope it'll come together pretty cool. Yeah, that's it. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.